Digital technology such as the Internet of Things is driving change in agriculture. So, what is the Internet of Things and what does it mean for farmers? The Internet of Things, or IoT, refers to devices or things that are embedded with a sensor so they can measure and transmit data via a network. Devices can mean anything from pumps, sheds and tractors to weather stations. Essentially, IoT means these physical devices can send and receive information via the internet. On farms, IoT allows devices across a farm to measure all kinds of data remotely and provide this information to the farmer in real time. IoT devices can gather information like soil moisture, chemical application, dam levels and livestock health, as well as monitor fences, vehicles and weather. Information generated by IoT devices allows farmers to track farm operations and performance, make better informed decisions to improve farm productivity and yield, and respond more quickly to their conditions, saving time and money. It's putting the data behind the all-important farmer gut instinct, whether that be knowing when to check on water supply to a trough, how much fertiliser to apply to a crop, and which you to check during lambing. There are a lot of use cases in the agriculture industry that IoT can help you to solve. But for each use case, the final solution will be slightly different even if the general system architecture is based on the same principles. The core of every IoT system is data. Lots of data. The architecture of IoT system has to provide an ability to collect data from sensors, store data for analysis, analyze the data to gain insights and share the gained results with other systems or users. Now I am going to show you the complete example. There is a farmer who lives in a faraway house. He owns the field with poppies, but poppy is very prone to mildew and other diseases that can damage the whole yield. What can farmer do? He could repeatedly spray with fungicides and pesticides the whole yield. Or he could identify the problem in the right moment and spray at the right time on the right place. And thus, he could save costs, reduce environmental impact and produce more and better poppies. But how can he do it? He can place sensors to different parts of the field to measure environmental and climate conditions and plant changes. Then, data from all sensors are transmitted to a central unit where it can be processed by a software. The software is designed to manage sensors, analyze their data, visualize the results and set rules for notifications to inform other systems or users about important situations. Such system can be really helpful to the farmer who can react immediately to each situation and helps him to treat or harvest appropriately and thus protect his pressures and make some savings. That's it!